network interviews, the high pressure, high profile interviews was a mistake? You know, I don't know. I hope from tonight forward we will understand we got an asset on our hands. Were you worried about her going <laughs> not, into huh? Were you worried about her going into this debate based on the attention paid to some of her interviews with Couric and Gibson you and know, on and I, on? You know, I've been in this business a long time and when you first start, I worried about myself. Mm -hmm. Does one slip up define me for the rest of my life? And the general answer is no, the American public is, is very fair, but she's been battered and bruised a lot here, I think unfairly. And tonight was a, I was pleased. I was really pleased that people got to see the person I've come to know. And uh, after tonight, if we don't use her more, we're crazy. Were you worried going into the night? Uh, I was confident she would do well, but you never know that it's over. And when I turned to Joe Lieber and sitting by me, and I said, that's the Sarah Palin we've been trying to tell people about. So I think tonight she had a uh, likability, uh, the ability of people to understand where she's coming from in life, and that she's probably closer to the average person's life than the other three combined, quite frankly. And she's smart. She's tough. There, this, this lady is not a 15-second soundbite. She's lived a very eventful life, and she's done some tough things. Being a politician, the hardest thing in the world is to tell your own people you don't agree with them. And uh, she's done that in, in circumstances that I think show that she's a very tough person. If she's Thank you, Senator.